or yeah. whatever you call the... I like the wood uh, aesthetic to it. It's, it's pretty cool. Yeah, well, when I built this, this was built this height because I built this right when the, uh, the Rostock was released. Yeah. And it was, you could not buy these belts from any supplier. Everyone was okay. backwards. So I found some that had them like in this really long lane, and then the rods, not like the website that was listed on the build of materials was um, some weird lane hardened shaft. Okay. And, like one, they're expensive, and two, they were out of stock. So it's like this is drill rod. This is five dollars for three feet. All right. So okay, the three feet. I'll make it three feet. <laughs> and I just nice. I thought I should stiffen it, so that's why it has the braces. Nice. Oh, you've got okay. Because you could cool. probably take these off and just run it with these. Yeah. But eventually, now that I have this, now I'm you got your little get one. Get these laser cut, and make this one even, make it smaller, but make it even bigger. Okay. Value. Like my goal is, I want to print this to one. Right. Oh, okay. We have to print, but <laughs> what? How did work? Did you design this on your own, or did you? Um, it's all on Thingiverse. Okay. So all of these pieces are just downloaded. I designed these. Um, big shooter uh, gearbox. I kind of designed. Oh, cool. Um, but most of it is all open source. Like the Z Pro, I modified um, some from Thingiverse. And you printed all these parts here. Yep. I like how you can see the. Uh, the extruder there, right? Yeah. That's cool. So it's one thing, the biggest thing I learned with this one is you do not build your own extruder. Right. Because this one I had so many problems, like the filament would like come in here and just come out of stuff. Like I don't even know how but it come out. Hmm. I bought this from CME CNC, it was twenty dollars. Okay. It is the best investment in any printer. Nice. But it's made for direct uh, direct drive. Okay. It, I kept skipping um, uh, steps uh, and I'm running the motor at 1.7 amps well okay. higher than what I should and it's still so I built the gearbox to use it's the stock weight gears okay so normally this would run where this would be your stepper down here and this would be a, um, a hop bolt okay and you'd have and I just I cut that all off and made it so this just bolts right to it and works flawless cool. very nice a little mini mini delta I like it and this is all built for speed. The goal is to print at 300 on this. Okay. Right now it's, I told it 200, but it, I think 